You've reached 980-555-5432. Please leave a message at the beep. That was nice and uninformative, wasn't it? Are you sure you called the right person or business? Hard to tell. That's why it's important to set up a professional voicemail greeting. Connect with your customers even when you can't get to the phone. Here's how. First, make sure your caller knows they've reached the right business. Something like, you've reached ABC Company. Next, let them know what information you need to better serve them. Try saying, please leave your name and number and let us know how we can assist you. Finally, tell them when they can expect to call back. All calls will be returned within 24 hours. Thank you. It's important that your voicemail greeting sounds professional and polite throughout, so keep that in mind too. Now that you know the components of a good voicemail message, follow these quick tips to record the perfect professional greeting. Write it out on a piece of paper, practice it a couple of times, record it in a quiet place, and start over if you need to. Need some help getting started? Listen to these examples and feel free to plug in your own information. This is the voicemail of John Smith at ABC Company. I can't answer your call right now, but it is important to me. Please leave a message with your name and number and I will return your call in the order in which it was received. Thank you and have a good day. Another example is something like, thank you for calling ABC Company. We are unable to answer the phone right now. Please leave a message with your name and contact information. We will return your call as soon as possible. Please note, calls received after business hours may not be returned until the next business day. Now that you've got some insight on how to record a professional voicemail greeting, write yours and get it recorded. If you've enjoyed the video, give it a like and subscribe to our channel for more helpful business tips. See you next time.